Clover Go comes ready to set up and take payments in just minutes. In the box, you'll find your Clover Go reader, a micro USB charging cable, and a quick start guide. You may also have received the optional stand and charging dock. Before you start using Clover Go, be sure to charge the card reader for at least an hour or until the red light stops blinking. You can use the USB charging cable with a laptop USB, portable charger, or wall charger. If you purchase the optional stand, you can charge the reader in the stand while it's connected to a power source. Now let's get your Clover Go connected. First, download the Clover Go app onto your smartphone or tablet. It's available on the Apple App Store and the Google Play Store. We'll go ahead and launch the app. The setup guide will walk you through a few important settings. If you haven't signed up for a Clover account yet, tap Apply Now. Otherwise, log in with the same email and password you use to set up your Clover account. If you don't have a login, look for an email from Clover asking you to confirm your email address. You can also visit clover.com and select Login to reset your password. Now we'll be prompted to set notification and location sharing preferences. We recommend turning both on. Notifications ensure you receive important account information and location services help protect you from fraud. Next, you'll also set your Touch ID or Face ID preferences if you have these features on your phone or tablet. Now, let's pair the card reader via Bluetooth. Remove any earphones from the audio jack during this process. Turn the card reader on by pressing and holding the power button for five seconds or until the blue light blinks. On your smartphone or tablet, tap Pair Contactless plus Chip. If you have more than one device, select the device from the list, confirming the correct reader by verifying the number found on the bottom of the reader. If the pairing is successful, the blue light on the card reader will stop blinking and remain on. If your card reader does not pair immediately, press the power button for five seconds again and repeat the steps. Plus, there are accessories that can make accepting payments even more convenient. To learn more about getting started, go to clover.com help.